Lady Gabriella Windsor and fiancé Thomas Kingston will tie the knot at St George's Chapel this spring The venue is the same as Meghan Markle and Prince Harry and Princess Eugenie and Jack Brooksbank used when they married in 2018 The two royal brides of 2018 both paid tribute to the Queen Mother, but will Lady Gabriella do the same? Will the Queen have to approve Lady Gabriella's wedding dress? Why the Queen won't be involved in Lady Gabriella's wedding as Lady Gabriella's spring wedding approaches royal wedding watchers are eager to find out what traditions the bride-to-be will follow One tradition, which started with the Queen Mother in 1923, relates to laying down the wedding bouquet on the tomb of the unknown warrior at Westminster Abbey in London The tradition started with Queen Elizabeth's mother, Elizabeth Bowes Lyon, who became the Duchess of York and later Queen Elizabeth when she married the future King George VI in 1923 By doing so, the Queen Mother honored her brother, Captain Fergus Bowes Lyon, who was killed during World War I Royal.co.uk writes, Almost 100 years ago, Lady Elizabeth Bowes Lyon, known as Queen Elizabeth, the Queen Mother, established a long-held royal wedding tradition As Lady Elizabeth entered Westminster Abbey on her wedding day, the royal bride stopped to lay her flowers at the tomb of the unknown warrior The gesture was in remembrance of her own brother, Fergus, who died at the Battle of Luz in 1915, and to pay tribute to the millions of others killed and injured in World War I Lady Gabriella Windsor wedding dress, what could Lady Gabriella wear? The strange wedding traditions Lady Gabriella may have to follow as Lady Elizabeth laid her flowers on the tomb, as soon as she entered the abbey, she was the only royal bride to actually walk down the aisle without her bouquet Many royal brides have adapted the gesture since then, laying their flowers on the tomb as they leave the church instead of when they enter The touching gesture has since been done by many royal brides Lady Gabriella, who will wed at St George's Chapel in Windsor, could be sending the bouquet down to London following the ceremony, just like Princess Eugenie did when she married at the same venue last year Meghan Markle, who married Prince Harry in May last year, also paid tribute to the Queen Mother with this gesture The Duchess of Sussex's wedding bouquet was filled with forget-me-nots, scented sweet peas, lily of the valley, a stilb, jasmine and estrancha, and sprigs of myrtle, and blooms picked from the gardens at Kensington Palace by Prince Harry himself, and was placed on the grave of the unknown warrior at Westminster Abbey after the wedding Both Princess Eugenie and Meghan Markle married at St George's Chapel in Windsor and sent the bouquets down to London following their ceremonies Whether Lady Gabriella will do the same is not clear yet, but it's not unlikely she will follow in the footsteps of former royal brides, 